Mr. Williams, in a press conference on Wednesday, said the TTFA board voted unanimously to dissolve the commission. However, its former head says the recommendation to dissolve was sent in a letter to him to Mr. Williams if certain criteria wasn't met, namely finances to start the new league. And, and I don't have time to be throwing the wrong agendas or anything. And it, 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 is there any letter? So you know I congratulate Mr. Williams. You know why? He dissolved the commission. <laughs> he took my recommendation. You know what the only problem is? He should have dissolved it on August 16. That was the date I gave him. The point of the matter is, if we don't have the money, we can't play football. He reiterated that football needs money to play, and that was not supplied by the TTFA. The Ministry of Sport delivered. They delivered their money to the sport company, and the sport company now is working with the Pro League to ensure that there's compliance and that they will give that funding over there. And we had an agreement in place in the way that money will be used to go forward. It was all perfect. It was all agreed upon. But it was dependent solely on the TTFA receiving money to start this league. So I have a real, real issue when our president comes out and says that we did not live up to the expectation. Gillette says the TTFA president needs to tell the truth about what is happening in local football. Sitting about five man committee shows, shows no common sense. Stupid. You don't have the money. If you don't have the money, you can't start the league. So you want them to come back and say, well, you know, we don't have the money. Why don't you take the front and say we don't have the money? You are the leader of football, whoever it is, the leader in this country, whether it's the CEO of, 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 of um, TTFA or whether it's the chairman, I don't know, the president, and say, gentlemen, I have, I have to make a statement. We do not have the money. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.